Buck Hill, owned by Loman and Miller, Joe Pavia Jr. Two is Samarama, owned by Mary Ann Georges with Brad Hanners. The three horses, May I Have This Dance, owned by Jeff Fountain, Bruce Soulsby with Jeff Fountain, the Sulky. Four is the Darby's Edge Stables Western Pursuit and driver Mike Wilder. Number five, Confessor, is owned by Christina Gallops with Jack Daly. Six, Lord Tinsel, is owned by Parker and Berger, Jim Daly. Seven is Buggy Wrench Dandy, owned by Ernest Hageman with Jamie Dunlop. Number eight, Highly Rated, is owned by Darla Conklin with Don Feaster. The nine horse is Travis Hanover, owned by Caserta and Potter with David Myers. And number 10 is Blast the Siren, owned by Davis and Arnold, Randy Tharp. Their way to the backside for the start of tonight's 11th race. There they go. And they're off. Samarama is out fast along with May I Have This Dance. Confessor from the center of the course and Travis Hanover gets away well as they race around the far turn the first time and it's Confessor and Jack Daly up to grab the early lead. They open up by two. Can I Have This Dance driving up after the leader from second. Travis Hanover rolls on from third. Samarama next in fourth. Buck Hill is fifth. Two and a half back to Blast the Siren followed by Western Pursuit and two more to Lord Tinsel followed up by Buggy Wrench Dandy and Highly Rated. They're by the opening quarter in 27-1 and one, and passing the stands for the first time. Jeff Foud wanted the top with May I Have This Dance and the 8-5 to five favorite has got it now by just over length. Travis Hanover hung on the outside second followed by Confessor at the rail in third. On the outside, that's Blast the Siren driving up three wide from fourth around a tired Travis Hanover as they make their way around the clubhouse turn. It is May I Have This Dance on top. Blast the Siren into second. Confessor is third. Western Pursuit only two and a half off the pace setters in fourth. And the half goes in 57 seconds flat. Heading up the back set. It's May I Have This Dance on top. May I Have This Dance just over length. Blast the Siren now kicking into gear. Getting up to the leader's flank in second. Confessor a tight third in the pocket. Western Pursuit right there second over fourth. Along the inside, Samarama gaps out fifth. Two more back to Buck Hill, followed by a weary Travis Hanover. Lord Tinsel is locked in. Highly rated a Muggy Ranch Dandy. Three quarters, 125 and one. Around the turn of the top of the stretch, it's May I Have This Dance on top by a length. Blast the Siren has seen better days. He's dropping back in second. Followed at the inside by Confessor. Western Pursuit driving up on the extreme outside. They've got an eighth to go. They're driving in the stretch. And May I Have This Dance has the lead. Here comes Western Pursuit. Buck Hill center of the course. It's Western Pursuit short lead. Buck Hill way out wide. Samarama the rail. Buck Hill getting up. Western Pursuit and Samarama 154 and 3. It's official. Exact to 1 4, 64 even. The try 1 4 2, 361, 80. Back in the winner's circle, Buck Hill, six year old black gelding by Sydney Hill from Bright Flair by Oil Burner. Owned by Sturgill Lohman and Walter Miller of Ohio. Alex Spence, the trainer, Joe Pavia Jr., drives Buck Hill to win number four on the season, 154 and 3. New lifetime mark for Buck Hill. <laughs> 